Hey everybody, it's John Broadwell from Broadwell Consulting Incorporated, creator of the Serial Wombat Open Source Project. A uh, quick update today, something that I think people have been looking at for a while. Uh, there are now available under the Docs and Links page on SerialWombat.com two PDF documents, a user guide for the Serial Wombat 4B chip and a user guide for the Serial Wombat 18AB chip. And these two user guides available in PDF format uh, go through the various pin modes that are available on each of the chips, uh, talk a little bit about the environment and the libraries, uh, point to a whole variety of videos and GitHub links and things that you might like to, uh, to reference in your Serial Wombat 4B related project. Uh, the 4B guide now is up to uh, 41 pages. The Serial Wombat 18AB guide is up to a whopping 119 pages. So lots of functionality in these chips. In the past, it's been kind of hard to see just in one location everything that they're capable of. But uh, with these new user guides, I'm hoping that you'll be able to easily browse through these and maybe find some functionality in the chips that you're already using that you didn't know existed. So again, those are available at SerialWombat.com under the Docs and Links page and just click on the PDFs to download them. So until we talk again, have fun and keep making stuff. The Serial Wombat firmware is available on GitHub and is constantly being updated. Subscribe below so that you can see the latest features and videos that come out as we fix bugs and add new features. The Serial Wombat open source project was created by Broadwell Consulting Incorporated. Broadwell Consulting Incorporated provides help developing medical devices with a focus on developing embedded firmware which is compliant with IEC 62304, ISO 14971, and ISO 13485, as well as remediation assistance for products already in production. For more information, contact John at Broadwell Consulting. Support requests for Serial Wombat should be sent to help at serialwombat.com and will be answered on an as-available basis. Also, feel free to leave your question in the comments below.